friends now let us solve this problem of where moment is given in anti clockwise direction for a simply supported beam so again go for structural analysis take uh, material properties here if you check uh, 210 gp is there 0.27 uh, poisson's ratio is there so mega pascal so 10 newton make here so this is 0 0.27 meter. then close this particular part of those space claim so, let's start with the <coughs> first it is 2 meter so 2000 mm next again 2000 mm Next again at 2000 mm. Next 1000 mm. Okay, so right click finish, top to pad. Uh, the rectangular section is there. This area is 0.2 and 0.3 meter. So that is 200 by 300 is there. Come here. So beam profile. Click hit the beam profile. This is 200. This is 300. So close this part. Now go to structural. Assign all lines to the triangular section. Then go for shear topology. It is done now. Okay. So now come to same link. Yeah. So now front view <coughs> mesh give 10 mm as a mesh size. <coughs> so meshing is over. So go for a again the displacement data so one end you have to choose as a point so one end you choose then restrict all except z l trick value okay now it is done so go for another <coughs> remote displacement data so select the right side point so here x you give free so again why you take so x is free so you will this also zero so now you have to apply movement movement at the particular point if you don't know just go for this one so at 2000 distance we are applying a movement so here you go <coughs> component must be applied in a Z component so it is given as a 12,000 the value is how much here kilo Newton meters there so now do one thing you convert this in terms of a meter now now just ok so this is 12,000 Newton meter value we applied here <coughs> look at here if you put a positive it comes anti clockwise direction if you put a negative it will be clockwise direction okay so again apply a force which is a point force we're supposed to apply the location we don't know the location is approximately around four meter so go now and select here somewhere around approximately four yeah four meter. check here in between only um, two are there yeah that's fine so then here we'll be having only one Okay, so now come here, apply y direction 6000, but it must be negative. Okay, then one more force is there. Okay, apply at the last corner only, apply to the geometry, then component to choose negative again 6 kN force. So once it is done, cross check everything. Yes, now beam is ready to solve. Go for solving a problem. <coughs> okay, 
the solution is done insert share moment diagram in that you have to choose again inserting a path construction geometry for this you have to choose entire beam for the path definition okay now once it is defined so path you have to define by selecting edge edge you now select entire member so apply here the shear moment diagram you have to select the path what has been defined now here you choose y direction then shear force diagram then you go for a evaluate result so if you evaluate result it will calculate easily and displays even shear force moment diagram also yeah so look at here so whatever the solution obtained it is almost same in this section okay so thank you